welcome my friends welcome to another aimless adventures vlog now i don't always do abandoned locations and i don't always wear a kilt when i'm at an abandoned location but today you're getting two for the price of absolutely free if you subscribe youtube's absolutely free so what we got going on back here is the old las vegas shooting club not sure if that's the technical name get on your googler and find out all i know is i've never been in here they usually keep the place boarded up, locked up, and whatnot. And today the gates are open. And as you can tell, I'm rocking a kilt. Just got out of the Las Vegas Highland Games. I'm gonna go check out some of this stuff in the remnants. Not a lot to see, but it is abandoned and it's cool. I like guns, I like abandoned. Follow me. This is the old skeet machines. Anywhere you see these blocks along the line here, there used to be some machinery in there. It may still be inside there. And uh, when you stepped up to shoot, right over there, your clays had come out of here. Head on down range, and booyah. Looks like an old rifle rack. Put your shotgun in there. Hopefully you can hear me with this wind. It's pretty nasty out here. But yeah, you got your dowels right there. Which, uh, put your rifle in between there. The little cutouts right here. And usually you'll have something on the ground. But this is an old school place. So uh, they may not have had that stuff. I never got to shoot out here when it was still open. But you can see right there, you've got all the areas the lanes where you'd come in and shoot from and then uh, right out there the old box that's the where the, the um, what do you call them clays that come out of so this place there's a lot man there's a lot all the way down you can see it just goes there's probably I don't know 20 of them out here and there used to be a building I don't know if that's the end of the structure down there down that way but uh, it may have been tore up now abandoned, former Las Vegas shooting club, I think is what it was called. Some 410 shell remnants. These babies have probably been out here for quite some time. I don't know if we can get a clear peep on that. They're 410s, but can't really read. RP. I don't know if that's Remington or whoever. This is one of the clays that was busted up. Pretty fragile. Clay. Clay pigeons, they call them. And they are, uh, you know, as brutal as they sound. Clay. They just snap. It's not really not too much to it. It just breaks right off. You can see how many broken clays have been shot up. The whole hillside here, sand and then black. And that's not the color of the rock, that's actually the clays. They go all the way to that second hill. A lot of clays and a lot of shooting. Check that out. It looks like, it looks like flowers are in bloom, but those are actually plastic wads all kind of plastic wads from over the years shooting everywhere.
I'm sure there's zero chance that that is still functional. And that's not looking too good. Neither is this. Oof. It's just piles of like pigeon crap. Ugh. That's nasty, nasty stuff. This place is uh, starting to rot. It's a good thing it's out here in the dry heat of the desert, because if this were anywhere where there's humidity, it'd be toast. Not sure if this is a bad sign or not, but not positive, but I think that's an old cooling unit. Like an icebox deal. Yeah, looks like some type of refrigeration. Definitely seen better days. Looks like we've got some old seating over here. In a barbecue pit area. Pretty sure that's what these are here. Old brick lined cinder block on the inside. And you can see this one here has got a couple of holes in it. And I'm not 100% sure, but I think that may have been like a spit because there's a right over there. So I'm thinking maybe had a handle right there, kind of like that. Roast up some pigs or something. Old cooling units. Two power meters. And there's some old barbecues. Let's see if we can get around to those. Old dining table. Seating area. Yeah, that's an old barbecue pit. Super cool. Back in the day, old school construction. You can see how these things are lined to keep the heat. That's pretty cool, like an old table right there. Putting your fixings. Unless it's a lid that lifts. And check it out. I wonder if that was like a... Uh, like a little countertop, and then uh, you could order chow through there. Not sure, I don't know enough about this place. So if anybody out there knows anything about this place, post in the comments below. I don't really have a lot of info on it, I just wanted to document it. Because I have a feeling they're gonna tear this baby down. That chopper that flew over was uh, not scoping us out, but it did freak me out for a minute. However, another dude came along, kind of wondering what we were doing in here. Got a little info on those that uh, stone wall over there. Those are competition skeet shooting areas, so for trap. And uh, anyway, so that's what went on in there. That old school lighting. Very cool. Sorry about that wind, it's nasty out today. Well, my friends, we have reached the end of yet another Aimless Adventures vlog. Coming to you from the abandoned location that was, or is, it's abandoned now. It used to be called Las Vegas Shooting Club or something. Check your interwebs, get on Dem Internets and your Googler and check it out. So, like, subscribe, share, do all that stuff. Check down below for t-shirt links and blah, 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 blah.
and I think that's about it. I think, I think you really have to know when to hold them. Mm -hmm. yeah. And when to fold them. You got to know when to walk away. And when to run. And on that note, she gone. This is quite possibly the creepiest bathroom ever. Look at that creeper peeper hole. Who's back?